So today I'm here with the lovely Izzy. Izzy from the Actor Center. So Izzy, what brings you here today? Well, I'm an intern here, but I also go to the classes, and it's just a whole lot of fun. I've been going here for a little over a year and a half. Wow, so, a year and a half. So, what is it about acting that just draws you in? I really like um, humans. I like <laughs> the human spirit, and it's always intrigued me. Um, learning in school about different people, it's just the study of humans through yeah. impersonating other humans has always fascinated me a lot and I when I was little it sort of came to me easier than other things mm -hmm. so I was intrigued to get better right and so I came here and then you started on your journey yeah yeah so have you done anything in the past as far as like acting and shows or theater or television um, throughout my middle school career, I was in the musicals, and oh. I was in the musical this year at my in my high school theater group. Wow! Um, so yeah, I do. I sing a little bit. You sing? Oh, uh -huh. really? Yep. So, uh, are you going to give us a little bit of your lovely voice today? Okay. Sure. So, is there a particular like song or genre that you really, really love? Or um, I really like classic rock, but, oh. um, oh yeah, there's, I, I, that's like my main genre that I listen to. I switched from Top 40 like a couple years ago, because I was like, oh my god, how do people not still listen to this? So right. <laughs> so what's one of your favorite classic rock songs? Um, I really like House of the Rising Sun by The Animals. Oh, yeah. Can you please give us a little bit of that? There is... A house in New Orleans They call the rising sun And it's been the ruin Of many a poor boy And God, I know I'm one My mother was a tailor she sold my new blue jeans. My father was a gambling man way down in New Orleans. So I also hear you have another passion that you're really interested in. Uh, broadcasting. Yeah. Journalism. Yes. I thought about, you know, I was trying to figure out what to do because, you know, high school it's, oh, figure out what you have to do, yeah. like now. <laughs> so um, I was, you know, I always find myself in English class or in social studies class, I'm very involved in discussions mm -hmm. and I'm a bit of a, I go overboard a lot. So <laughs> I'm like, I need to channel this somehow and I'm always really wondering, you know, what's going on in the world, how do I, you know, just get right into the meat of it, right. and I thought, you know, I also have a passion for, you know, with the acting, so I thought right. broadcast journalism. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I was the same way, I felt the same way, as far as like passion yeah. towards broadcasting. Journalism, wanting to know more, wanting to know more about others, and incorporate in the world. So I, I can totally see that, but I'm just not as great singer as you are. Oh my god. But, uh, the other mm -hmm. stuff I do. Oh, so have you looked into different schools as yet? Colleges? Um, I've actually thought about NYU. Um, great school. Yeah. <laughs> and um, I was um, looking, my mom, she went to Syracuse University. Oh, okay. She yeah. was going into broadcast journalism. She strayed from that a little bit, but um, <laughs> no. I, I don't, it was weird. I figured it out completely on my own that I wanted to do broadcast journalism. And I wanted to get, you know, go somewhere with communications. And my mom yeah. was like, are you kidding me? I did the same exact thing yeah. in Syracuse. And I'm like, ah, I'm becoming my mother. <laughs> <laughs> so but then, you'll continue and you'll finish and then you'll go on. So then you'll surpass. Yeah, and I, I love languages. Yeah. I'm trying to be fluent in Spanish. Ooh. Telemundo would be so interesting. Listen, that's a plus. If you're basically dual in different languages, that would be yeah. really good for you. So you yeah. know very well. Me encanta español. So like it's <laughs> yeah. So what about you? Um, what what did you do in school to prepare for you know broadcast journalism? So I did a lot of internships. So it's very important to do a lot of internships. Um, I worked at a radio station for a little bit um, when I was like 
1718, and then from there, um, I just basically worked as much as I possibly could, like internships, not really like full-time jobs, but I would intern at different television stations and try to like to emulate and listen to what the reporters and the anchors were saying to me, and I would take and the producers, and I would take what they said to me, and I would really listen and hone in on my skills. So I thought it was very important. So the knowing the who, the what, the why, the where, very important, and also researching. So I would do that. A lot. Okay, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. So I think you're going to be a great anchor woman one day. You will. But you are very talented and your voice is so amazing. So you never know. You never do. You never know. You star. All these stars in here. Star power. Thank you. All right. That was awesome. Yeah. That's kind of what's that sing about? Oh, these voices. <laughs> I want to sing. <laughs> okay. So it was so nice talking to you.